How's it going, little homies? It's your boy, homie G, and I'm back. So I'm just chilling at the Barnes and Nobles, letting my kids look at the toys, read, play with the Thomas train, you know? So much fun. Anyway, so this post is about the most embarrassing things that can happen to you at school. And I know for some of you, school just started like this week. Maybe some of you a little earlier, like last week, and some of you next week. So what are some things that make you embarrassed at school? I know from when I was in school, tripping, falling, didn't want to do that because I'd just be imagining a bunch of people laughing at me, right? Never happened, thank God. But I also had this like weird nightmare about ending up in the wrong room and you know and just chilling in there and then the teacher would find out I was in the wrong room and they would say honey you're in the wrong room um, your room is mr. so-and-so or missing so-and-so and then I would be walking out and I could just feel all the eyes on me like they're just staring at me right and some of them would be giggling in my mind and just laughing what a loser you know he's in the wrong room how could he not know how could can he read a schedule anyway that was one of my uh, fear fear factors that I had about going to school and it was really mostly on the first day of school maybe on the second day but after that you know you know your schedule but it could be very embarrassing right what else um, I also was very embarrassed by let's see oh something happening to my clothes you know like in a stain or peeing in my pants <laughs> it happens hey you laugh too hard sometimes you know or what else um just just hey Rihanna, Josh, can't you see i'm making a homie g video oh sorry about that that was my my daughter Rihanna. she's playing with these great toys you see all these toys around me Barnes and Nobles has come up. Let me just say, Legos, uh, Batman, Darth Vader cars, Le uh, Barnes and Nobles has come up. All right, what else? Um, uh, John A, getting clowned by your friends. You know, you're in a circle, everybody's talking. You, you joke at someone's expense and then they have a better comeback than you do. And now everybody's laughing and you just gotta leave with your tail tucked between your legs, you know, you just got clowned. Nothing you could do, right? Really good. There's nothing you can do about it, but just say, hey, good good one, good one. You got me there, homie. And, and just shake it off, you know, and move on with your life. So there's lots of things that are gonna happen to you in school. Main point is you wanna be comfortable with yourself and you don't want to be feeling like you're walking on eggshells all the time at school. You should be comfortable while you're at school. And that's all I got to say for you, little homies. Peace out. I got I to gotta figure out where my kids are. All right? I'm out.